Hey everyone, it's Flackfire. Battlefield 1 will have a big showing at Gamescom this year, showing off a number of new developments to fans of the series. And could one of these be a new elite coming to Battlefield 1 within the name of the Tsar? Battlefield 1's first DLC expansion, They Shall Not Pass, added the brutal melee-focused Trench Raider. Equipped with a pistol and a massive trench mace, this elite is a terror in close quarters. Battlefield 1, of course, also has the Sentry equipped with either an MG-0815 or a Villa Perosa, the Tank Hunter with the Tigavir, and the Flame Trooper with the Vex. In recent builds available on the Battlefield 1 community test environment, data miners have found reference to the Italian Perino Model 1908 machine gun. Yet while the other weapons have been usable on the CTE for PC, there is no sign of the bulky machine gun. Is it possible DICE has plans for the Perino as part of a new Elite kit? There's no sign of a new behemoth for In the Name of the Tsar, aside from the winterized armored train, so a new Elite kit would be the next best thing. The Perino Model 1908 is a hefty machine gun, tipping the scales at 15 kilograms or 33 pounds. That's just 3 kilograms or about 6.5 pounds lighter than the MG-0815. Because of its weight, most of the time when it was deployed, the Perino was used as a stationary weapon. It fired from a 150-round box magazine and had a fire rate of 450 rounds per minute. This means it's probably a bit too unwieldy for the average infantry soldier. At some point, the Italians adapted the weapon for a more mobile role, giving it a shoulder sling and belt-fed ammunition. The soldier in this photo appears to be a Bersaglieri, Italy's highly mobile light infantry. The Italians and the Austro-Hungarians often use captured weapons, so it's not out of the question for one of them to wind up on the Eastern Front. But how would it work within the name of the Tsar? The easiest fit puts the Perino Model 1908 as a variation of the existing sentry kit in Battlefield 1, but I'd really like to see something a bit more unique and creative. The Trench Raider is able to drop a med crate and heal himself and nearby teammates. Why not have a more support-focused elite, able to resupply friendly soldiers? Perhaps give them some spotting flares or some improvised Molotov cocktails to help flush out entrenched enemies. It would be nice to have another elite that's more than just a one-dimension, heavily armed meat shield. Again, there is no official confirmation of a new Elite, or even if the Perino Model 1908 will even be featured in Battlefield 1's Russian DLC. But do tell me your ideas for a new Elite in the comments. It appears DICE will let loose some new details in the days leading up to and during Gamescom, which runs August 22nd through the 26th. They're promising new gameplay on a never-before-seen map included within the name of the Tsar, live matches, and a few surprises. I'll keep you up to date on everything Battlefield 1, so if you're not already, be sure to follow on Twitter and Facebook. And if you enjoyed this video, leave a like. And to take your Battlefield 1 game to the next level, check out the Battlefield 1 Ultimate Utility app with a link in the video description. Thanks for watching.